Hi, it's Ben Lapin. Hey, yeah, it's Joey. Playing the classic mode for Snake in Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Alright, the first round, fighting the Inklings. So, I'm guessing the theme for this one is um, different types of weaponry. Since I can't really think of any other way of linking the Inklings to um, Snake. But that seems like the most likely theme here. Although, I guess the theme could be Agents, since... Um, in the story mode for Splatoon 1 and 2, and also the Octo Expansion, you are playing as secret agents. You are trying to take down the Octarians, well, and various other different evil forces. So maybe the theme is agents, maybe it's weaponry. I guess I'll just find out with the next few battles. Anyway, that's round one cleared. Alright, round two is Diddy Kong. Okay, Diddy Kong definitely isn't an agent. So I guess the theme is weaponry, and different variations of weapons. Since he does have his peanut guns, which are a defining factor of his moveset. And with Inklings, it's the ink weapons. So definitely an interesting theme here. Theme of different variants of weapons. Some unique, some not so much. I mean, these first two definitely are very unique. But I reckon they'll probably be like... Um, Fox and Samus who just have regular blasters. Some other characters like that. Anyway, there's round two clear. Round three is Pit. Hmm, okay. So I guess it includes um, sword wielders as well. Although I guess he does also have a bow. So I guess perhaps that's why he's included here. I thought he was going to get defeated by that bomb there. That would have been very quick if that had happened. And of course the second one defeated him. That's quite a cool final shot there of just Snake just sort of flying off with an explosion off in the distance. Alright, round four is Link. Obviously his main weapon is the sword, although he does also have bombs and a bow. Alright, there's round four cleared. This is going very quickly, in general. I mean, there were a few slightly slower battles, but overall, very quickly. Alright, here's round five. Okay, so it's two Robs and a Samus. Oh no, wait, two Samuses. I think I'll just gonna throw some grenades, since that's the best way of tackling this particular stage with these particular enemies. Okay, there's one of the Samuses. Now just um, the rocks to go, I think, yeah. Okay. Alright, there is um Oh no wait, that rock's still alive, okay. Never mind that. I was going to say there is the fifth round complete, but not quite. Probably will be soon though, I reckon. I mean, unless I mess this up really badly, which I probably won't. But if that does happen, then... Okay, it didn't, because uh, there's the round third. Right now, fighting Snake. Although I don't know much about the Metal Gear series, um, considering the colour scheme and um, the fact that it's a snake versus snake battle, I'm assuming that this particular snake is meant to represent uh, Big Boss, I would assume. It's kind of the intended reference there. Although I might be wrong about that. There might have been other snake versus snake battles. And other evil snake clones. Or evil versions of snake, I guess. Would be a better way of phrasing it. Anyway, there's round six cleared. Alright, here is the boss fight. And the boss fight for this particular classic mode is Galibion. 
I think that's how you pronounce it. Galleon? Galleon? Well, it's the robot guy who first appeared in Brawl and is now in this game. Quite a good boss fight. I think I prefer the Brawl version, but this is still quite a good one. It's a lot simpler, but still very fun. Alright, just keep on hitting him. Yeah, I really like the design of this boss fight. It's simple, but it's quite a good design. Like, I like how there's the metal contrasted with the purple and blue. I think that looks really good. And also, it's quite an intimidating design with the particular face features, and just how it looks in general, and how armoured it is. Anyway, that is the classic mode for Snake, cleared. And that'll be it for this video. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe.